Hello, Carl here with Sustainability Theory News. We're over at the website for the University of Cambridge, and researchers there have found a new way to make artificial spider silk. Now, a lot of us might have one or two articles of clothing that has silk in it, or maybe it's completely silk. A lot of the real silk is made with worms, uh, mostly eating mulberry leaves, if I remember correctly. And it is a very energy-intensive process. I think Kazakhstan's the biggest producer of real silk out there. Spider silk isn't really used for clothing, but researchers like the strength and, tense and uh, tensile strength of spider silk, so they're trying to find a good way to make it without the use of harmful toxins or extreme temperatures as they have now, but this new method is done at room temperature with a solution that's 98% water and the other 2% is silica and cellulose, so two natural ingredients. Now researchers then take this hydrogel, they call it, and then stretch it out. They spin it, sort of like a spider spins its silk webs. And then the water evaporates 30 seconds later, leaving this artificial silk behind. It's a pretty interesting idea and concept. Now let's see what they can do with this silk. Maybe they'll make bulletproof vests. Maybe they'll just make stronger, nicer fitting clothing that doesn't wear out as quickly. What would you do if you had some nice strong spider silk? Leave it in the comments below. Of course, I will link to this article in the description. And if you'd like to see more news headlines like this, subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.